Welcome back, everyone, and thank you for joining us. Also, warm welcome to all the first-time visitors, and please remember to subscribe to the channel and like this video. And now, let's get started, shall we? The first tarot card is Five of Water. The Five of Water signals that you may be dealing with feelings of disappointment or loss. This card invites you to face these emotions directly, understanding that they are integral to your personal growth and emotional development. It is a moment for you to recognize what has not worked out as hoped and to learn from these experiences. The challenge and the opportunity lie in shifting your focus from what has been lost to what still remains and can be built upon. This perspective will help you to heal and find a new path forward. Explore these feelings more deeply, acknowledging them without allowing them to overwhelm you. Look for the lessons in these experiences and how they help to form your decisions in your journey. It is important to watch out for the tendency to dwell excessively on negative outcomes or to let sorrow keep you from noticing opportunities that are still available to you. Focus on potential growth and remain open to new possibilities. You can navigate through this period with a sense of hope and resilience, preparing yourself for a more balanced and fulfilling emotional future. The second tarot card is Knight of Earth. The Knight of Earth is a symbol of reliability, diligence, and integrity, embodying the virtues of loyalty, dependability, and kindness. This card appearing in the reading suggests that there is a person close to you who embraces these qualities. They are steadfast in their commitments, helping you to find a methodical, disciplined, and responsible approach to your troubles. You will get support with a serious attitude seeing any endeavors through to completion. This is a person who honors promises and obligations with respect and dedication. Whether you are involved in a project, relationship, or career goal, commitment and attention to detail are key. Be cautious of becoming too dependent or overly conservative in your methods. It is important to be reliable and thorough, but flexibility and openness to new ideas are also valuable. You are also stronger than you feel and need to find the confidence that you can handle the challenges you are facing right now. Balancing reliability with adaptability and independence when necessary will help you make the most of the energy the Knight of Earth brings into your world. Trust the guidance of your angels, and you will achieve your goals with honor and integrity. In this phase of your life, the universe is guiding you through a transformative journey where emotional introspection and steadfast diligence converge. You are encouraged to navigate through feelings of disappointment and loss, not by dwelling on them, but by understanding their role in your growth and focusing on the opportunities that still lie ahead. This process of emotional healing is crucial, allowing you to clear the way for new beginnings and stronger foundations. Additionally, you are receiving support and guidance, helping you to adopt a disciplined, loyal, and thorough approach as it is needed in your current situation. You must be open to learning from emotional setbacks. You should also solidify your commitments and see your tasks through with dedication and integrity. Be mindful, however, of the balance required between being dependable and flexible. You can trust the people around you, but you need to be the leading force in moving towards a solution. Embrace reliability in your actions while remaining open to the shifts and turns that life brings ensuring you can adapt and thrive in both your personal and professional life. This blend of emotional insight and practical perseverance will guide you towards a harmonious and fulfilling future. Thank you for listening to today's angel message. And if you liked the video and want to come back here, please subscribe to the channel. And I will see you tomorrow, my friend.